Hello, it's Diaz from the Curious VG and I'm here with Pulley Arif ahead of his massive fight on September the 23rd in Newcastle. Pulley, um, how's preparation been for the fight? It's been, been good. Um, been sparring three times a week. Uh, Mackie's five times a week. KFC four times a week. And scrambled egg and to on toast twice a week. <laughs> what would, would you have for breakfast this morning? I see you tucking into the buffet. Yeah, but to be fair, I wasn't that hungry. No joke, I was up every hour last night with the shits. It's so annoying. Um, I'll try not to swear because I don't want it to get you know taken down. But um, I was up all night. But so I had some wheat bits just to try to line the stomach. But I don't know if it worked or not. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, you've just done your open workout. How are you actually feeling for the fight with Spartan Jay? And is there anything you've seen in the small footage just out there that puts you in good stead for Saturday? <sighs> There's no footage out there. There's two fights that he's put out there both oh, look shit um, like the opponents his face he, lo he looks decent in them but what can I go off from them two fights nothing he put out one shadow boxing video I'm about to see him on the pads in a minute um, so yeah to be fair I don't really don't really care what he's going to be like I'm going in there and I'm putting on a show and I'm going to stop him that is the plan so obviously if everything does go your way on Saturday, what, what do you actually want next? Obviously you had that massive fight with Dean the Great. Dean the Great and Waleed have got another fight coming up in, in October. Is that a fight you're looking at closely? Yeah, of course. They're in my weight category. I'm looking at that. I don't see me fighting either of them anytime soon. I want to fight like people who have been into this into boxing the same time as me. Like I've been boxing two years now. I want to be fighting them people. Like showing them people what I've learned in two years and showing misfits, showing the fans what I can do you know what I mean with people who have been boxing the same amount of time as me obviously you did have that massive fight with Dean the Great um, what what have you learned coming off of that loss I learned a lot like I went in there and I'll be real I wasn't I was confident and I believed in myself but like I wasn't as confident as maybe I should have been and I should have been because I feel like I done well like I got knocked down got up showed good heart um, I've caught him a few times, someone who's been boxing much longer than me. I caught him a few times. Um, respect to Dean, he's a sick fighter. But yeah, I'm, I took quite a lot from that fight and I'm confident going into my next fight. Wicked. Obviously, can we have a final fight prediction from you? St round three, stoppage. And a message for the fans watching. Obviously, you've got a lot of fans. What's the message for them? Um, tell your mums to shout me. <laughs> <laughs> and final message for small Spartan Jay. So if he's watching this, what have you got to say to him? Um, I hope you have your wheat a bit. And I hope Snow White's all right. Sam, thank you, Pulley.